All right, so it is Sunday, October 23rd, 2022. On another piece of water today. Um, I haven't actually fished this in a few years, but I did wade through here uh, this summer when the flow was down to about 33 CFS. I think that was our summer low. And I did manage to spot a few trout in July hanging out in the uh, deeper water. So I was like, yeah, what the hell? Give it a shot. Today it's uh, about 58 degrees. Still supposed to get a couple more degrees out of the day. If we get to about 62, that'll be great. Water temperature presently is 49.7 degrees. I got the river to myself and uh, see what happens. You know, can't tell you until you try. So I'm just going to wade up into this beautiful autumn scenery and uh, yeah, maybe I get one. Maybe I won't. No net today. So that's usually lucky for me. Let's see what happens. Um, very curious, very curious since it was a brutally hot, brutally hot and dry summer. I hadn't seen this river down that low since I was a kid. Got low, so low one year we couldn't tube it. So we used to tube this river all the time. And, uh, eventually you just get tired of scraping your ass up against the rocks, you know. So... Let's see if it produces any fish for me today. See what happens. Alright. Okay. So I just... I had tied on a pheasant tail. And then promptly missed one. The odds of getting him the second time? I don't know. I'd say the odds are a little slim. Okay. But a pheasant tail. I've fished over him... How many times with a freaking hair's ear? So, all of a sudden, a beat up pheasant tail. Is what's doing the trick. And he was not that far in front of me. Not at all. I was actually kind of surprised. Like, that was close. I hope that fish has a shitty memory. I'd say that fish probably went no more than 12. You know. But I don't know that that fish will want to bite again. It's hard to say. What's that moving in the water? I don't know. That sure was fascinating. But there's fish here. Like that's a fish. All right, that's a fish. There we go. Nothing crazy or fantastic, but it's a fish. It'll do. I did come out here to catch fish. Nice. Okay. That was on the pheasant tail, going around and around. Come on. Oh, you want to go? Got a little spirit, do you? Come on. Come on, right over here to me. Come on. 
And I'm only on a two pound tippet, so I'm not horsing anybody today. Here we go. Come here. Oh, come here. Come back. No, no. Ooh, got some. Got a little. Ooh, got a little bit of. <laughs> got a little bit of pep. So, I mean, like, we're right at that 50 degree mark, you know. They're eating. Come on. Hook it nice and solidly in the upper lip. Come on. Come here. Thirteen exactly. Come here. Come here. Whoop. There you go. You're gone. Go ahead. Swim. Be free. Nicely done. Thank you. Let's see if we can get another one. Pheasant tail. Number 14 pheasant tail. And I do believe that was one of Joe Curry's pheasant tails. Because he definitely ties the nicest pheasant tails I've ever used. Oh, we're actually getting some sun on the water. Now that's a treat. It was supposed to be all cloud today. And here we are getting some sun. <coughs> all right. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. There's one. Whoop, where'd he go? Whoop, and he's gone. Woo, look at him go. Wow. He's pissed. There he goes. Zing, gotcha. <laughs> this one's not happy. I can't say. I haven't even seen him yet. He's, ooh, he's nice. Oh, he's very nice. All right. This is turning into a very nice day of fishing. Okay, what are you going to do? What's your play? What's your play? You done? You done? Did you peter out early? You gonna let me? I got a little bit of weight to you. Yeah, I didn't think you were done. <laughs> Again, two pound tippet. I think I'll wait. I'm just, I'm not fighting him hard, so I'm not tiring him too much, but he's got to like get the idea in his head that yeah, he's done. Come on. All right, keep your head up. No, nope, he still wants to go deep. And I have no net, so, <laughs> you know, 
I'm not. I can't just like scoop it out of the water. He's got to be a little. He's got to be a little cooperative at this point. Come on. Okay. I'm bringing you up close. Jeez, maybe not. Gosh. This looks like a fall stalker. Either that or it's. Oh, it was a. Come on. Come on, get your head up. Get your head. Ah, this, one, this one just does not want to keep its head up. Come on. Oh, that's a nice fish. And I don't want to lose it. Having no net and all. Maybe what I should really do. Let's give you a little bit of line. Let me clean up this mess that I have going on right here. It's a strong fish. You know, the one nice thing about the cold water is that they don't tire nearly. And again, I'm on two pound tippet, so. Come on. We gotta get you, okay, we have to, at some, at some point, we kinda have to end this. There you go, whoop. To the top to the top there you go now you're done you're done come on oh Jesus this fish isn't just not done oh that that's a chunk and that comes in at right at 15. That's gorgeous. Beautiful. Thank you, sir. Settle in on the bottom. Yep, you're doing good. Beautiful. God, it's wonderful. Boy, this fishing stuff, it's fun. Ah, oh, okay. So, uh, the big question is, is was I actually filming? Huh.